I get some more honey, that's what I'm about. Said I never do it after coming out the house. Look at look you in the back, you slip a bad girl. For 27 years, try to slip and go. Tell these niggas I got too much up. Tell these niggas I got too much up. You got too much up. Yeah, yeah, I got too much up. Tell these niggas I got too much up. I got two months old. I'm a for new sale. Where my brother's at? Y'all connected on a new scale. I see my nigga blast through a mask. Y'all got me covered. That's my brother with the cash in. I'm a fat nigga with a boss fit. If no one ain't packing, y'all can tell a boss tip. Where's the mister? I'm the special referee. I'm on the crystal from the past. People don't know that. What is it? It's the end. It's the end. If you rap with the fuck with Jimmy, then you win. I enjoyed every second on stage. The crowd was so welcoming. Ah, oh, everything I pictured. Yeah, yeah everything yeah. I envisioned. Awesome, awesome. So, do you think you'll come back next year? I'm trying to work so hard that I'm here every year. So I'm not giving people a reason to sleep on me. Uh, I took a little bit of a two-month break, just trying to recoup, sorting out a few things. But I'm back. I'm back. Oh yeah, and how was that break? What did you get up to during that whole thing? Really the whole break was about moving. I was moving, doing a lot of things, you know, trying to sort out a couple of things in the personal life. But I'm back, baby. They can't stop me after here. Yeah. yeah. Now tell me about trying to bring back the old school sound. Was that you just trying to accommodate the boom vibe cats? Because now everyone is traveling, yo. So now you coming with that boom vibe sound, was it just to say, okay guys, you're not left out? It's it's more of a strategic thinking thing you know it's yeah. like firstly I felt I feel very comfortable doing boom bap yeah. it is me it's something I can't deny uh -huh. secondly when I look at the industry everybody's doing the same thing yeah. you know like one one person gets on stage the next person gets on stage like you don't know if that person said to fed you you know yeah. so the whole point I, about it was I had to stick out like a sore thumb yeah. be so different and I feel like to the old school, to the, like I said, to the new kids, it feels brand new and to the old ones, it feels very refreshing. So I made the choice and I'm happy with it. I'm a happy man. Awesome, awesome. Now in terms of bringing it out there, how do you think people are receiving or rather, would you say the commercial side of it is not really receiving it well or are they receiving it at all? I think it's actually getting a whole lot of love. Yeah. Um, everywhere where I go, people recognize, people appreciate. Yeah. It's so good to see OGs come back and say, hey fam, thank you very much. Yeah. You know, and it felt great. I mean, I just met Amo just getting off stage and yeah. he hugged me and he said, bro, thank you. And that for me just gives me like, yo man, it just makes me happy. Awesome, man. So where to from here for Jimmy Wiz? Uh, where to from here, we're about to drop the mixtape, it's called ATJ, yeah. according to Jim, it's got 12 tracks, it's about to be beautiful, um, just sorting out the listening session real quick, I might just invite y'all to the listening session. You definitely should, <laughs> we'll hold him to that. <laughs> so I'm going to invite y'all, we jam it out, tell me what you guys think, I know it's hot, so I just want a second opinion, and I just want to know which guy, which singles you guys think should roll out, so yeah. that's what's going to happen. Awesome. Well, there you have it, people. It's Dynamis, Jimmy Wiz, way out.